Hey, good morning guys. Right now it is um 2.31 the um, morning and um just to let you know um I'm actually gonna be heading for the um airport right now. But my sensei told me to wait five or six minutes. So five or six minutes shouldn't take that long. But anyways but anyways I'm gonna go ahead and check out first. So I'll be right back. Let's go check let's go check out. We gotta make sure we close everything. First, let's get the luggage out. Good, everything is locked. So I'll be waiting for Sensei in the lobby. I'm gonna go ahead and place a key card in the front desk because no one's gonna be here in the morning. They must all be sleeping, so we need to be aware we're quiet in the hallways. No one's here because everyone needs to be sleeping. But we will sit in the couch and wait. So anyways guys, this is the room I was um, staying in for one night. But um, I'm actually about to be um, leaving now. So how did she give herself a heart attack? I mean, but what was the cause before? Mm, too much stress. That's true. People who have tangles of stress can easily get a heart attack. That happens to most of all Americans here. So right now, since I think her well fully dressed now, since I have the hotel cars to replace you on the counter first. No one's around here, so I gotta keep quiet. Okay, so there we go. Done. So let's say goodbye to this fancy hotel here. There you go, Sensei. Since we're going to today's hotel, it's very peaceful and quiet around here. Sorry about that. Excuse me for a second. So why don't we have to watch your steps? Sensei, when you get back, when you get back from the airport back to the same hotel, can you tell Terry that um, is, is Terry able to come to the home dojo this Sunday? Uh, yeah, she might. So can you tell Terry that I'll see her at the home dojo this Sunday? Because yeah. tomorrow I'm because today I'm finally back at night class today. Yeah. All right, thanks, Sensei. Whoa, everything's kind of like, you know, lots of things around the wall and stuff, and... So, Sensei, when I finished the ribs that you gave me and your wife gave me, I was completely full. I wasn't hungry mm -hmm. in the middle of the night. Mm -hmm. Because I managed to manage my hunger because I wanted to lose a lot of weight. <sighs> because my dad said that if I keep eating too much, I might be overweighted, that's all. Plus, I just found that I just had, like, around, um... 200 something left, that's why I'm saving the money for a home dojo. Because it really was a high price, yeah. So right now, Sensei is driving us to the um, hotel right now. I mean, to the airport now. So goodbye hometown and see you again soon. So Sensei, are you able to come back to Small Surf Jiu Jitsu Summer Camp next year? Well, I won't know till, till later. <laughs> Probably, but I don't know. So probably, right? Yeah. Cause Jessica's, cause Jessica Oakland's probably, probably might co be coming back ne next year actually. Mm. This year she couldn't make it because she had lots of things to do. But um, just to let you know, um, Chris, I tested Chris saying that um, saying that um, Will just promote me to um, Pearl Belt and he said congrats. 
So you were happy to see me get for more, right? Yeah. Right, Sissy? Yeah, I got police action over here. Um, remember Ian Lowan, the fifth degree black belt? Yeah. He, 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 he does actually work for a police session, remember? Yep. He, used to when people try to tell him, he would use Jiu Jitsu based small sort of Jiu Jitsu. But guys, we have a police intercession right here, so it's probably best not to, you know, stare at them. Or they were saying that, they, they were saying that someone's spying on them. Are you flying out of? Um, for next month? No, today. Um, di um, United. United? Okay. Thank you, Sensei. So, this is where Rob and I had lunch the other day. The okay. steak and shake. Yeah. The burgers there are less expensive. And plus, most of the time, um, they're like, you know, under four dollars. I chose the one that was under four dollars before. Had fries and clue because it was free with it. So basically, um, the other day, um, Sensei Mori, Josh Mori, told me that um, he went to the what is it, um, you know, um, the Great Rose Cafeteria that you introduced me to it last year. This year, then I go because it didn't feel like it. Yeah, I want to try other places. Yeah. And remember, Bob was my um, saint or something. Mm -hmm. Bob, Bob, Rob, um, Bob, um, Bob was not able to make it this year. So Will Higginbottom told um, Rob to take care of everything for me. Okay. Um, Which I appreciate it. I spoke with uh, Will last night. Mm hmm And you were supposed to share expenses on the room. Yes, I understood. Okay, so I have his number. Okay. I have his address. Mm hmm uh, I'll try and contact him and find out how much you're supposed to pay. Okay, and then I can send a chat to Will, right? Are you gonna send a check to Ron? Um, but I don't have Rob's this thing. I have his number. Okay, but you can give it to me when I get off to the airport now. I'll, I'll give it to Rob. Well, I could, and then you can call him yourself. If yeah. I know how much you have to pay. Understood. Okay, that'd, be, that'd be a good thing. You can thank yes. him for. You know, he went out of his way to actually pick you up at the airport. Um, in the middle of the morning. Right? Actually, um, Rob was the one that paid me. Will just picked up a guy from right, Europe. That's what I'm talking about. Yes, uh, that's the one. Okay, give me when we arrive at the airport. Actually, I'll give you the information now. Sure, yes. It's on my phone. Mm -hmm. Okay, there it is right there. Um, plus one, three, on one. Your phone. Copy it on your phone. So here's my friend's number, so pop, I, 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 am um, captured already. Okay. Even, even though I'm filming the street, I can, like, you know, watch it, um, there's a capture button. Gotcha. Which allows me to, yeah. So basically, um, the food at this place that, um, Rob and I had there the other day was where, where, um, good or something, it was Old Charlie's. Old Charlie's? Yeah, their um, chicken tender was actually very, very um, fresher, fresher than the ones in Alameda's KFC, because Alameda KFC seems to be extremely too dry, actually. Nice. Oh, it's a chicken place, Old Charlie's? Um, Old Charlie's is like a chicken place, a salad place, a burger place, and also a um, rib place and other places, yeah. I see. There's more than just one, actually. Okay. So there's one more over there, yeah. There's Sonic. So you leaving this early, you're gonna get home at about 9 or 10 o'clock, aren't you? Um, I'm actually going to be heading back to Amiya College to hang out. Yeah, but when you when you get... Are you going to Oakland? Um, Alameda. Uh, airport. Um, um, San Francisco San Airport. San Francisco? What time, time do you arrive there? Um, I check my flight schedule and it says I'm supposed to arrive by 7.15 a.m. in the morning. Wow. 15 minutes early, say. Well, I hope your flight will be on time. It is actually on time when I checked at 5 a.m. in the morning. Okay. So since we're giving me Ross phone number, I'm definitely going to what I'm definitely going to what is it? Um, definitely call him and like you know what is it? Um, and what is it? Um, and what is it? Tell him that I'm doing it my but I'm able to do that transition July once because I'm saving it for the home camp. No, no, no. You pay him. You pay him now. Okay. Okay. No way. 
Got you. Because he paid it out of his pocket. I got you, Sensei. Okay. Right. Things were telling me. Yeah. You should also ask him if you can pay him for some of the gas to come pick you up at the airport. Yeah, I guess so. Okay. Okay. It's, it's the right thing to do, right? Right. Because otherwise, you'd have to call, catch a cab. Uh huh. I understood. Okay. Yeah. I understand what Sensei Six are telling me. Okay. So I'll pay him when I get back to Alamea, yes. Or I can do the airport, but I didn't want to disturb him because he might be sleeping. So I'm going to wait until when the sun rises where he's in. He's in Memphis now, I believe, yeah. Yeah, if you wait till. Uh, I'm just going to wait till morning. Then I'll pay him. You wait till you get to Oakland or to San Francisco? Yeah, that's It'll probably be, be a good the time. Right time. It'll be, yes. be about 9 or 10 o'clock for you. Yes, got it. Because I'm, he's heading back to Shreveport, yeah. yeah. Because I understand that I'm getting promoted at the home dojo by you, Sensei. Yeah. So basically, you told me that you told me that you did like you know what I said um have a like you know promo belt which is a new one that is like you know inside the um inside the what's it um drawer right size five right yeah I think I have but I won't know till I get home cool tire claw sensei sensei yeah. so when I get my belt belt it's okay if I have my name engraved on it just like the same belt as yours actually this says one size you can have it engraved sure I mean, I just want to have my engraved just, just like, just like the same one, like you know how the other masters and small search would you just have them? Yeah, you can do that. Okay. I don't, I don't know who can do that for you, but you can, you can get it done. <clears throat> yes, that's what I mean. Yeah, the one that says small circle jujitsu and the and the other side that says Calvin Lee. Remember? Yeah, you can do that. I don't know how much it costs. Okay. But um, as Leon said that the um black belt inside the Indiana one was around a hundred, right? Or was it two hundred fifty something? To do a belt? To 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 get promoted for black belt in Indiana summer camp. The uh, the fee for testing for a black belt is a hundred dollars, something like that. Yes, that's what I mean. But um, but um, yeah, yeah. But if I um definitely pass it, that is yeah. You know what I'm saying, right? Yeah. Well, you impressed a lot of people here. Yeah, most of the time I impressed a lot here. Just I wanted the black belt to be the same as yours. Like it says, small search jujitsu on the on on the left side and the right side. It says um, David Quinones, Remember? Yeah, that's my belt. That that's what I mean. I really want it to be like just like the same one. Yeah. I see. So what time did you came back from Wales? Around midnight? Um, I think we got back about 12.30. Half past midnight? Yeah. So I've been asleep for about, just about two hours. Two hours? So Sensei, Six are sending me right to the airport. Deeply appreciate it. When I get back to um, San Francisco, I'm definitely going to ask. Um, I'm definitely going to ask um, Rob, R O B, right? Yep. That um, how much? So how much am I supposed to pay? So I pay half of the um, room that I stay with him. You stayed there two days, right? Um, yeah, two days, yeah. Okay, so you asked him how much the room was for one day. So how much the room was from um one day? And then you paid all of that amount. Yes, and plus, and, and yeah, that's it. So I asked him, um, how much, how, how much is it for one day that I pay half, yeah? Because I didn't want to treat him Rob so unfair, yeah. yeah. And then offer him maybe, um, offer him maybe twenty dollars for gas to take you to the airport to come pick you up. Um, yeah, I guess, but mostly, um, he did. He told me that, um, 
he was the one that did not fill up the gas before he went to the um, airport. He was the one that did it in the afternoon before he went to the hotel rest. That's what he told me. Yes, but he used the gas he used in the car. Oh yeah, the, oh yeah, he, he was driving his own it. car, yeah. He has to replace it, right? Yes. Yeah. So I guess $20 should be good, yeah. $20 should be plenty. Yes. Okay. Yes. Understood. Or you don't even have to ask him that, since you know that he did that. Mm -hmm. After he tells you how much the room costs, yeah. The room costs. When you mm -hmm. send a check, you just send twenty dollars more. Got you. So okay. half room for on um, one day plus twenty, right? Sixty-five more. Um, were you talking about sixty-five more? Was it a freeway? Um, Northwest Light from last time, right? Yeah. They when you send me, right? Yeah. I cannot believe a bot was not be, bot was not able to make it from lack from from this year. Yeah. You remember Bob, don't you? Right. Uh -huh. Bob the small surgeon. Did you sue him? There's a couple of Bobs. In. Yeah. Not the one that was um, here this year. I mean the one that was here last year. Yeah. The second Bob, not the first Bob. I cannot believe it's Sensei Canvas already finished. Now I'm starting to miss Sensei Mori again and also Chris Perry, his student, I guess, yeah? Yeah, they're good guys, aren't they? He, he, he's very cool. I believe Chris sent me a friend request on Facebook the other day and um, I remember Chris um, sending me a Facebook request the other day and I said to yeah. So I had a picture with him and his, and his um, Sensei Josh Mori before he, like, you know, was it, um, before he, like, you know, was it, um, left for like you know was um Atlanta yeah. but Josh said um but Josh said if I ever stop by Atlanta I can come to his dojo to train for free yes yeah but not get promoted that's what he told me yeah, yeah. but but um he told me that I'll need to text him yes what I'm saying right sensei okay yeah, no. since I have him on Facebook he always uses Facebook a lot, but there's sometimes that he'll be on vacation. Yeah. So I need to figure the most appropriate time that is. Yeah. yeah, by the way, I see the airport up ahead. So that means we must be getting close by the airport, right? That's correct. So usually it's like 10 minutes to camp, right? From here, right? Um, we'll be in there probably in about five, six minutes, yeah. So it's really, really um quick, yeah. I, I already checked in online yet. Yeah. All I need to go to the counter is to use it's to it's to um have them check my um what is it um price flyer I'm saying so I can earn points yeah that's all I need to yeah since I'm since I have a membership card that part of Singapore Airlines United is alliance partner that is the same family with it. I see. Man, it feels it feels great to start your own 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 live chat on on, on video while filming the outside saying that I'm like you know that I'm most of the time this is the city that you visit yeah it can be part of your memory yeah. that's why I wrote to YouTube so I can like you know what is it um get some like you know what is it um wheels and guess if I and if I get more than 10,000 YouTube would definitely send me some kind of a saying I can handle was the golden play button yeah. yeah most of the other users have it yeah that's why I decided to create I believe my friend was the one my friend was the one that showed me how to um how, how to do it. That's why I figure out that um using my friend's idea earned me a lot of views. And by the way, I have like around um 15 subscribers for now. Okay. Other people were asking, were asking me what was my um, YouTube um YouTube account name, and I told them for some random names. Yeah. So I see a FedEx and there's a tower, FedEx plane. So more inter. INDPLS International Airport Ronald Reagan Parkway Ameriplex Parkway yeah Man it's like almost 20 minutes now yes Yep So I guess it's so my guess is 
game from here here to the um, home dojo would be around 25 minutes. Yeah. If you're driving, you yeah. Mean down to Morville. Yeah, to Mooresville, yes. So here we are, Indianapolis International Airport. By the way, um, I had a friend from Amiya High School. Um, he graduated. He was actually one of the students there on the, in the senior sack pain or something. But now he's graduated this year. Yeah, he's heard this because this is the home of some sort of an Indianapolis Grand Prix racetrack. That's right. One so of the most, one of the most famous. Yes. So so basically, um. I, so basically, when I went into the what is it, um, airport area where I was supposed to, what is it, um, when I was supposed to, what is it, um, see the cars, I told picture of the Indiana race cars, yes. Yeah. They're pretty cool, aren't they? Yeah, I'm definitely, when I go inside, I'm definitely going to, what is it, um, find out, um, more, um, more of the, like, you know, Indiana, like, you know, racetrack cars, yeah, and take all of them, the pictures, yeah. yeah. This is going to be added to my Facebook album of, Indianapolis um, race cars album. I decided to create it, yeah. It's an album, yeah. Because I've been, because this is the city of the most famous race car, yeah. So you know, this is the second time I, I, I was coming here, right? Yep. So right now, um, I told um, I, t I told all the other senses there about I'm sponsor Jason and even you too. And the ones that are part of the family like that, saying that I'm working on my green belt, so they, sh so they were impressed to hear that, yeah. I still remember how to do a rain finger lock. It's like the fourth finger to the rain this one. You have to like, you know, once it put pressure to it. Once it's aligned closely to the fingertips, you have to push it in to like, you know, once it um, release the pressure. Cause it has to react in pain in order to work. If it doesn't react pain, it's definitely not going to work. Oh yeah, so basically, um, there's it's the um, airport up front. Thanks to master, um, Quinones or Grandmaster, yeah, or Sensei, yeah. So I believe um Leon and his um younger son um Lian are um are leaving for um this airport t t today evening. They told me yesterday, Leon, Leon J. Yeah. So um Leon told me that um he's going to be like you know what I'm um, transferring planes, but he's going to make it. But he's going to make it back to San Francisco. He's going to make it at San Francisco in the evening. By right, Tuesday. Monday evening, yeah, like around 11 p.m. That's what they told me. So let's look for Sango United. There's the tower. So guys, we're fine. So guys, we're finally at um, Indianapolis International Airport. And man, it's like almost um, 3 a.m. morning. Since the master Dave Quinones, who's driving me there. So departures, yeah, solid as yeah. Yep. Le Leja does means arrival in Spanish, yeah. I only learned a few Spanish words, which I didn't learn a lot, yeah. So um, this hour, so this Saturday when you return back to um California, you're return this back to rental car right here, right? Yes. So Gary, go I see planes, yeah. Well, it's been an honor, Sensei, for like, you know, what I'm um, going to small circle camp again. So by the way, this was parking garage. This is where Rob paid me up last time. Level two inside this parking garage. Yep, yeah, so so you're taking this flight back to Oakland, right? This Saturday, right? Delta, right? No, we're going on American Airlines. American Airlines, but are you, so, so, so are you taking Southwest and transfer? No. So it's man, there. this is finally the International Airport. Delta. Um, United, um, Elegant Frontier, American, American. One Jet, um, Air Canada. United is right there. Okay. Yeah, so finally here is United in the front. All right, all right, thank you, Sensei. You're welcome. Thanks for bringing us again, it's been an honor, pressuring, pleasuring. So I'm here to get my luggage out. Tie this around my neck, just like I usually tie my belt around it in case it falls. Yeah, so this is the forest blower, and finally, I'm at the airport right now.
Alright, have a safe flight, Calvin. You, you too, Sensei. Wait, bye bye. Right. See ya. I'll see you um this um Sunday, right? See you Sunday, Sensei. Can't wait to get my pearl belt from you after Leon throws me, then you can throw me, yeah. Because right. Grandmaster's gonna meet her. And I want um since Leon and I are getting promoted together, I'm his younger son. So Leon and I are definitely gonna throw each other for promotion, yeah. Because purple and purple, yeah. See ya, Sensei. So by the way, he is leaving now, and I will see him Saturday. Right now, we're entering the airport. So by the way, so by the way, I'm gonna check it now. Catch you later.